So if this were traditional, what would it be called? Knidla. Can you repeat that? Knidla. Knidlin. And you said it's traditionally like bacon. Yeah. Wow, this looks really good. I'm so hungry. Oh, I just had dinner with my host. Um, the food was really good. A very generous size of food. So I didn't even finish it, but it was delicious. I'm very grateful he took the time to cook. Um, so yeah, I'm actually just about to get ready for bed. Just brush my teeth, wash my face, and I'm going to probably read a little bit and then go to sleep. Thank you so much for watching my videos. If you have, I really appreciate it. Um, I'm definitely going to get better with time, so please be patient with me. And now I'm just rambling, which I'm trying not to do. So yeah, good night. I'll see you guys tomorrow in the next clip. Good morning. So I'm here having my coffee. And my breakfast, my couch surfing host is so freaking like, I don't know, sent from like the heavens. He just goes above and beyond like anything that I could ever ask. Like he doesn't have to do all this stuff, but he does. It's great. Honestly, we'll just see what happens when we get to the city. I'm not even like particularly looking to go any certain place. I just want to get a feel for the city before I leave tomorrow morning to Paris. And yeah, it's kind of like wet outside, so I'm gonna let it pass while I do my writing and my reading. And yeah, um, once we go to the city, I'll catch up with you guys. So I'm getting ready to go out. Um, very slow morning, but I do want to show you guys my couch surfing place. I'm not gonna show his whole place because it's unsafe, but I will show you like the bedroom that I'm staying in and some possibilities of places you could possibly couch surf if you decide to take that route one day. So it's pretty much like you walk through this door and it's a pretty basic room. Um, the bed's here, super comfortable. Like I've been super happy to sleep in this bed for the last two days. It's made such a difference. So I've been really grateful for that. We have some mirrors here and me and my crazy outfit. Um, let's go this way. And then here is the bathroom that I've been enjoying for the last two days. It's been a great place to do my wash day routine. So I've been super happy about that. And that's it. Honestly, I say this over and over, but couch surfing has been one of the best options for me while budget traveling. No regrets at all. Honestly, I've decided as of yesterday that couch surfing may be one of the highlights of my trips because I get to meet so many like, I get to meet the everyday people rather than, you know, having to find like a stranger and be like, you know, how do you like it here? And just, you know, kind of bug them. But with couch surfing, your host kind of expects that you'll be curious about everything that's going on. So, yeah. Um, if you guys want me to do a video on like finding a couch surfing host and like the process that I go through, the questions that I ask myself or the questions that I ask my host, then let me know and I'll do a separate video about it. But for now, I'm going to go get ready because I'm taking forever. So now I'm just walking to the bus stop and it's so peaceful, so peaceful. Very hilly, but very peaceful. I really do like this place a lot. There's so many trees. This is a lot to be happy about. <laughs> Oh my 
goodness, that lunch is so good. I'm so full and so happy. Guys, tip, if you wanna keep a girl, just keep feeding her, just keep feeding her, keep feeding her. But anyway, I'm on my way to some Notre Dame or Notre Dame, I'm not sure. Anyway, I'm gonna let the church do the talking. But how do I get out of here? I don't know. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. I'm going to do some more exploring of this awesome fortress. Um, tomorrow I'll be headed to Paris. And yeah, I'll see you guys in my next video. Thank you so much for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. See you guys in the next one. Bye.